We see in this is Parash and Parash Vayikra, a person commits a sin, he feels sorry, he wants to ask for forgiveness from Hashem, and Hashem will forgive him. It sounds like a very easy process. If you just bring a carbon, everything is fine. But it's not that easy, actually, because the Pasuk says, V'chipar Allah v'akoyim l'fnei Hashem. It has to go through the process of going to a kohen. Bring the carbon through the kohen. Now question, why do I need another person there to help me out do the carbon? Why can't I do it myself? I have done the sin. I feel bad. I feel sorry. I want to ask for forgiveness. Let me bring the carbon to Hashem. Why do I need another person there? Why do I need a kohen help me out? Isn't it easier to do it myself? Why do I have to go through this embarrassment? Go through the kohen. Well, the answer is yes, you have to go through a person. You have to go through another human being versus just talking to Hashem. Talking to Hashem sounds very easy, very simple. We talk to Him all day. But it's just in our imaginary figure how this goes through. When you talk to Hashem, you talk to something spiritual, something holy. That's very nice. But in real life, how is that going to go through the process for your real true feelings that you feel bad, that you did something wrong? For that, you need a real person. You need the Kohen standing there and asking you, oh, which sin did you do? What have you done? And why did you do it? Well, do you really feel sorry? You feel bad? And all that is going to bring out his true feelings and his true willingness to turn back to Hashem. And then Hashem says, yes, now I can really forgive you. Because now I see that you're real and you're true with your asking for forgiveness. That's why we need another person to help us out go through the process. That's why we have tzaddik in today's days. Everybody has to have a rebbe, friends. You need another person to be able to go through a true process going through Hashem. Because talking to Hashem is easy but really talking to Hashem is hard. Because this is all in our imagination how that works. For that reason, let's just do it with a smile.